Hi everybody, I am Leah Bartha, creator of Be The Method, and I'm gonna walk you through a short upper body workout where we focus on opening up the chest, we're gonna focus on arms and shoulders and back, and also this nice transverse abdominus muscle of the deep core. We're gonna start with your feet just a little bit wider than hip distance apart. We're gonna soften the knees very slightly. I'm using some three pound weights. You can do five, you can do one, one and a half. You can also do this equally with no weights, whatever you have on hand. We're gonna slightly bend those knees. We're gonna take your hands into your shoulders. We're gonna go into a nice lift up to the ceiling and and then bend, take it down. So what we are doing here is we're just starting to find how the core is connected to the arms, connected to the lats. We're gonna think of this as very full body while we're also tapping into the arms. And let's go here, up and down. So even though this is a short workout, we're gonna try not to power through any of the movements. We're gonna to try to deeply activate all of the muscles, still move with intention, finding the resistance and strength through space. And let's keep going. We're breathing through, in through our nose, out through our mouths. Up and back. Good, let's do a few more here. And two more. And then last one. Now we're going into a very slight forward hinge. Now we're gonna bend the elbows in. We're gonna push the hands out, bend in, stretch it back. We're gonna go in, pushing out and back. So as we're doing so, we're focusing on pulling our weight back into our heels, giving your toes a little wiggle so that you activate some glutes. We're gonna find some inner thighs, a lot of core as well. Back, let's go forward here. We're gonna to try to focus on some alignment in the spine. So making sure that your head is not lifted up or your tailbone's not tucked. And back, good, here. And back, let's do a few more here. And two more. Let's do one more. Good, we're gonna lift yourself up, slight bend of the knees, taking your palms facing into the body. We're gonna bend the elbows, we're gonna go into a lift and then take them down. So we're going here, feeling how we're connecting through the bicep, through the lats, through the core on this lift. Knees are slightly soft so that we can keep a neutral spine. We don't wanna tuck the spine and we don't want to arch. And let's keep going up and down. So if you're doing this with no weights, I want you to feel as though you're pushing up with the resistance, dropping it down. Try not to let gravity take your arms down. We're really using every direction of the movement. And let's do a few more here. And two more. Last one. Good, we're gonna go into a slight forward hinge. We're gonna to start to just go into little tiny pulses back with the arms. We're finding the core. We wanna try not to pull your weight forward onto your toes. We're shifting back onto your heels. Give your toes a little wiggle. Keep going through here. Really nice. Let's do a few more. So we're activating some lats, some triceps, keeping your chest really nice and wide. A couple more. We're gonna take your hands together. We're gonna bend it down a little bit lower. We're gonna push those hands back, opening up the shoulders. So while we're working the arms, we also wanna mobilize the shoulders. Make sure that we're still focusing on length, mobility and stretch while we are working on strength. And back, let's keep going. And back. Let's do a few more. Two more here. And one more. All the way back. We're gonna step your feet a little bit wider now. We're gonna take one hand on your hip. You can also take one hand onto your pelvis if you have no weights. We're gonna take your palm facing forward. What we're gonna do here is we're gonna push it up. We're gonna bend it in. We're going into a stretch up and over. So it goes up, in, and over. We're gonna go up and over. Really nice. Feeling how we're connected to the oblique as well, so it's kind of a bonus to get some of that core work in while we're doing the upper body. Let's go over, in, up. Last one here. And up. Let's switch to the opposite side. Palm faces forward. We're gonna go up, in, over, up, and over. Really nice. Up through here. Over. Two more. We're breathing as well. Good. Over. Last one here. 
and over. Really nice. Coming back to center, we're gonna take both hands in. We're gonna do a little punch and then we're gonna open. So we're gonna go punch forward and open. We're keeping the knees soft so we're not hyperextended. We're also not moving the body with our arms, okay? We're finding some really nice stability through the trunk of the body, forward, back. This is the last little piece here. Let's do a few more. Two more here, breathing through. And then last one. And then now to end, we're gonna fold yourself all the way down to the floor. You can drop your weights if you have them. Slowly start to walk your feet about hip distance apart. We're gonna nod your head and shake your head here. And then slowly soften the knees and we're gonna fold yourself up one vertebrae at a time, letting your head be the very last piece. And when we get to the top, you can roll your shoulders back and you're all done. Great job.